this distance of 5,000 meters. What we'll see on the track today he continues on the track here at the Nike Prefontaine Classic, the conclusion of the men's 5,000 meters now. And it is Aragawi of Ethiopia. Berega has now just moved into second behind him, but Aragawi now running alone with a chase group of four men. You know, he was really the only one that stuck with that second pace setter, and he had opened up a lead, but at this point, his lead is lead here over an incredible field behind him. So this is 3,000 meters complete up. This is an interesting race out of Tafera. This is his first 5,000, and he is hanging in there in that second pack there, running really well, and also we see Wally. This is absolute domination by Aragawe. He has just powered away. He is running away from Olympic medalists in this event, world championship medalists in this event, and it looked like there was a little discussion in that, that second pack as they just crossed the finish line about 100 meters ago. They wanted someone else to take the turn to pull up, but I can't underestimate how good that pack is that he is just blowing out of the water and he looks so good and focused he's really been working hard but that's how you get a beautiful this is really fast and he's got two laps to complete as you mentioned earlier sub 13 is a magical time for men in the 5000 it's very prestigious to break 13 minutes there's only been one this year last night that we got to see here at the prefontaine classic and he's doing this but he's doing this on his own he doesn't have anyone to chase anymore he doesn't have anyone to work off of really he can just even if he looks up at the scoreboard all he sees is himself well, the amazing thing, and that's the beauty of the Hayward Magic, he's not running alone when you have a crowd like this that knows and understands and appreciate what the reigning Diamond League champion trying to put together a Diamond League win, and it would take unmitigated disaster not to pick up the victory here today. But now, how fast can he make this last lap around the track? Again, the world's fastest time set just last night by the world record holder of Uganda, Joshua Cheptegei. 12.57.99 is the great battle on the back stretch that we just saw there for the uh, top spaces between second and fifth. But off the final turn in splendid isolation here with the crowd on their feet at Hayward Field. Aragawi, look at the time on the clock. He is going to obliterate that world best time from last night. And he goes to a new meet record as Barega and Mo Ahmed of Canada is fourth. Well, what a way to start the distance running here. The celebration will continue, and we'll be back to Hayward Field in a moment. Fastest times in the world this year, and Berahu Aragawi of Ethiopia, a new personal best and breaks the meet record of Mo Ferris here at the Pre-Classic. And we are just getting started, coming up live.